Guys, I'm thanks a lot for listening to this continuation of the series of uh, video that we have begun on uh, Python uh, learning. So today we're going to show you how to use uh, variable, how to create and use variable in, in, in Python. So uh, you don't know that first of all, uh, variable are content in which we can so store element uh, which can be numerical or, or string. So variable can be uh, various kind. So for this, uh, uh, in this tutorial, we just focus on string and uh, numerical variable. So uh, the first thing to do is to uh, so uh, let us come back on what we did last time in our introductory tutorial. We have shown you how to create a function. So uh, my function has been created and was called uh, main. So this is the instruction that we will use in order that has been uh, used to create a function by the keyword def followed by uh, the name of the function and the bracket and uh, the, uh, the two points. So uh, at the end, we have defined a condition in order to, uh, to call our function, which is uh, what you can see on your screen. So uh, coming back on variable, the first thing to do is to give the variable a name. So uh, I will create a variable that I will call, for example, uh, here of birth. My variable is called here. Of birth. So note that you cannot uh, space is not allowed uh, between uh, to separate the component of the variable. So you cannot also put a special character such as uh, slash, star, negative, plus, or uh, you can use, for example, underscore to separate uh, uh, the component of the variable here of. So uh, the first thing you to create, give a name to your variable, and secondly, you should assign to your variable a value. So I will assign the assignation symbol in Python is the symbol equal. So I will assign to my hero bird the year, for example, 1987. So I create a, a numerical variable to which I assign the value of 1987. So I will use the print command in order to uh, ask Python to print uh, my year of birth. So uh, I will write print. So we have seen this uh, predefined function last time. So I will print my variable called uh, year of birth. So I will put into bracket the name of the variable. Here of birth. So I should keep at least two uh, lines between the end of the function and the uh, instruction that I have write, uh, written in order to uh, execute uh, to call my function. So I click on the green button here to execute my code. You see that there, are, there is a missing. So what is the problem? Problem is the space between here should be a so I will read the tweet to see. Uh, voila. So, uh, my uh, year of birth has been printed. So, you see that the value that I have assigned to the uh, year of birth has been, uh, has been printed. So for now, I will uh, uh, create a program that will uh, calculate, for example, the year of birth, my year of birth, giving the data that will be entered in uh, that the data that will be entered. So I will uh, right here. Uh, this symbol in order to uh, tell uh, Python not to take into consideration what I am reading right now. 
compute uh, calculate the age calculate age so the instruction that I am going to write right now is uh, to calculate age so I will create a variable a variable called age in which I will assign the variable uh, the, the value uh, 2020. I suppose that we are in 2020 minus year uh, uh, of birth. So year uh, of birth. So I will uh, calculate. I uh, assign to the variable age the value 2020 minus year of birth. So when you uh, make this operation you will obtain the uh, age of uh, the concerned person so it's, if i uh, go in my green button here and execute my code so you will see that uh, so i didn't uh, print so i will print uh, in i will print the value uh, You are, uh, I use quotation mark called string. You are space plus the concatenation symbol. I concatenate, I concatenate two variables, two, uh, two things. So I use uh, print you are plus. Uh, uh, so I will put here. Uh, H you are plus H I will put here H here old space plus uh, opening quotation mark uh, quotation in quotation mark uh, here So uh, in Python, it's not uh, possible to concatenate a string and uh, numerical variables. So I will use uh, the uh, the variable str meaning string to transform it to uh, to help my. Uh, variable uh, be recognized as string. So I will put space after R to uh, have the space between uh, U, R and uh, H. I will also put space after, uh, before here to have uh, a space before H and here old. Here old. So I can just uh, execute my uh, program so you can see here that uh, you are 33 year olds have been printed because uh, the, val the previous value assigned to the uh, age uh, to year of birth was uh, 1987 and uh, the age calculated was 33 according to the mode of uh, calcul that uh, of calculation that uh, I have uh, shown in the I have uh, given in the program so I can change uh, for example the uh, year of birth into 19 uh, and if I execute re-execute my my code you see that uh, here is 1919 and you are 30 year old if the age which were entered in my command was uh, 1919 you train you are 30 years old so um, you can for example uh, continue in our in my in our program by uh, Print it uh, uh, by uh, writing the program 
in order to show you uh, by continuing the program in order to show you how you can ask to uh, Python to enter uh, the age to enter age in order to uh, uh, in order to him to for him to calculate the uh, your your age. So uh, I will create a variable called name, so you will uh, understand a little bit of bit further. Name equal. Uh, I will ask uh, Python to input the command. Input is the command that is used in order to uh, tell Python to ask a value that we will enter and. Will uh, produce a result, so uh, I will you I will put into a uh, bracket open uh, uh, quotation mark enter enter the name enter the name and uh, secondly I will. Uh, Assign to the variable uh, here of birds. I will assign to the variable my variable here of birds the variable uh, the value uh, inputs. Input uh, enter enter the uh, here of birds the year of birth. So after that, I will. Uh, I will uh, assign to the uh, to the value. I will assign to the value uh, here. H. I will assign to the value H. I will assign to the value H. the value uh, so uh, uh, Python cannot recognize input uh, enter the enter the here of as uh, as numeric and so I will put uh, the, uh, the function ins in order to tell him that uh, the error word that will be input will be numerical ins is the command that is used in order to tell him that the value that that is going to be enter is going to be uh, so I will assign to the uh, to my value uh, uh, age as uh, previously the value uh, 2020 negative uh, year of birth. So at the end of my uh, at the, of uh, the program, I will print. Uh, I will print uh, name. Name is a string variable, so I will not put quotation mark. Name plus space plus uh, is plus I will also I will uh, copy this uh, part of the code here or Paste here. 
copy and uh, paste. So uh, at, at the end, Python will print a uh, name is uh, space here, string age year old. So uh, the op objective is uh, of our program is is, is to ask uh, Python to. Uh, so I will delete the what we have written first uh, concerning. Here of so I will just uh, keep this uh, this part of program. So I will give the name. Uh, so you will input your name into uh, Python, and Python will, will calculate your here of uh, your name and your here of birth, and Python will calculate your age and print uh, your name and your age at the end of the course. So I will execute uh, my program so that uh, you can see what is uh, what is being uh, done. Enter your name. So I will enter my name uh, Chiu for D. Enter. Enter your year of birth. Year of birth I will enter uh, 1987 and, and I click on enter so what is written is chill for the is 33 year old so you see that uh, you can do many things using a variable in Python so it will just uh, an introduction so uh, next time we show uh, uh, to you uh, many other uh, notion that you need to know in order to very well master Python. That was just about the Bible and thanks a lot for listening to this uh, tutorial and we'll see you uh, a little bit sooner.